Hi guys, it's Marvel Money, and today we are looking at day 9 of the LEGO Star Wars 2023 Advent Calendar. On day 9 of the Advent Calendar, we get the little droid speeder. I quite like this, I don't think I ever got one when they first did them as sets. And I don't think I've already got one since, so this is the first for me. Uh, it's quite nice, it works well with the B1. The only thing I do is swap one of the arms to this arm, otherwise it will not work. Uh, you can have both arms on there, and you can of course switch the orientation of the arm, have it flipped the other way around. I like it like this just because I like to think he's like jump, he's either going up or down on there, so it works fine for me. Uh, we do get a nice assortment of spare pieces too. I like that the translucent cylinder has been used here to give it the kind of rise off the ground. And we've got a small green base as well. I feel like any terrain it might be going over. They do a good job of kind of concealing it being bound to the break by having this piece down here. So it is quite a good structure to it, I should say. Um, but yeah, very nice addition to the calendar. It's nice to have something that uh, accompanies the droids really well than something that accompanies the clone troopers really well. And I think. The calendar last year did that with Rebels and uh, Imperial Troopers, so the Stormtroopers and Snowtroopers I think it was, so it worked out really well, and they've done it again this year which is quite nice, so it makes me very much look forward to how they handle it next year, and what else we might have in the calendar to accompany the minifigures and other characters. I've been Marvel Manny, and this has been Day 9 of the LEGO Star Wars Advent Calendar.